I like this. Tell me about it. How did you get on the bandstand with Nipsey Russell? Okay. <laughs> so that band that we won the battle with right. bands with, a few you months. You were a teenager with that. Teenager. Yeah. Um, we had gotten, somehow we were good enough to get a job at the Stevensville Hotel in the Catskills, playing in the teen band, okay. in the teen room, for the whole summer, you know? And it was something like... I think it was like 35 or $40 a week each. And we had rooms, we were okay. like we were like 14 or 15. Wow. It was like, I think I was right before I was 15. Because yeah. it was September I turned, mm -hmm. I was gonna be, so it was that summer. And, um, and so it was our first time like ever away from home, you know, where we'd be like, you know, we weren't under the auspices yeah. of, our, of our parents and so, you know, all the guys were just, you know, we were all in like one giant barracks, you know, <laughs> and all kinds of, we were, you know, they wanted to drink beer and, you know, uh, and I remember, um, so there was like a house detective that always be watching, keeping an eye on us, you know, and we were like, oh boys, you know, so we were, one night we were playing in the room and the house detective was waiting there with like some very well-dressed gentlemen and um, we, we thought we were gonna get busted for playing too loud. I had like a big, you know, I had gone from my Univox quickly to like a, I saved up and I got like a Fender Basement 100. Okay. So I thought we were, so we, we got busted a few times for just playing too loud. You mm -hmm. know, they keep it down, you know? And um, so these guys came in and they said, um, we were like nervous, we, they didn't, nobody wanted to stop playing because we figured, you know, if we kept on playing, they maybe we'd just go away, mm -hmm. you know? And uh, so it turns out it was um, Nipsey's manager. He said, you know, uh, Nipsey heard you guys from the penthouse, you know, and, and, mm -hmm. and uh, he's like wondering um, if you could play the show with him tonight. He says, um, do you know the Funky Chicken? And I was like, I didn't even know the Funky Chicken. I said, sure, I know the Funky Chicken, of course. <laughs> so, so we got up and um, me and the drummer, he hired me and the drummer. And it was like, it was like really like kind of old show band, sure, sure. you know, a bunch of old guys. So they wanted to say, you know, we saw these young kids and battled them. And so they brought us up and, um, and we played like this, you know, we played like a funky blue thing, blues thing. And, you know, they put us in the front of the stage. It was probably, you know, over a thousand per wow. people there. And, um, you know, the spotlights, it was like total showbiz. And, um, uh, we ended, you know, we played, we played the tune. It was like a huge success, and um, and after the show, they came came over to us, and you know, like the manager peeled off like a hundred dollar bill for me and a hundred dollar bill for the drummers. Is is that okay, guys? And we were like, oh yeah, it's great, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> we just like made more. We were like, I was like, showbiz, this is it. I'm in. Here in the club. I mean, and it was so funny because like years later, I. Uh, you know, when Smokey Joe's Cafe was happening, uh -huh. I was like subbing up there and up on the upper, uh, you know, in the, on 8th Avenue in the uh -huh. 50s, and I saw Nipsey. Oh. He was like sitting, walking around in his white suit, and I was like, Nipsey, I just have to like, I went over to him, and this is like, you know, we're talking 30 plus year, you know, mm -hmm. at least 30 years later. And I was like, Nipsey, I just want to tell you, like my one of my first times ever, you know, like my first kind of show busy professional gig, uh, I was, uh, we were at the Stevensville Hotel. He was like, Stevensville Hotel. He said, and um, I said, yeah, I said, um, he says, you know, I was, a, I was a bass player. He says, he says, we didn't play the funky chicken, did we? <laughs> <laughs> I said, we certainly did. <laughs> and he was, he was like, he kind of like almost had a tear in his eyes. He was a really cool guy, That's you know? Nice. So that was fun. So that was like my first taste of like, I was like, oh wow, this is fun. Yeah, you know? this is a show, this is this, my life. This is like, I, I was, I was kind of hooked after Nipsey.